Hey guys, how's going? This is Covid from Corda Covid YouTube channel and welcome back to another video tutorials on Python programming and from this series of video we are going to start our web development uh, video tutorials with Python and we will be using Django framework for this and I will be guiding you what the heck is this uh, Django and what is framework and others and how it is made okay so <clears throat> let's understand how we will start this course so we'll start by uh, making some parts of these videos uh, in this series you can go and check the playlist if you are going to watch the next video too and if you haven't subscribed our channel don't forget to subscribe so first thing you need is <clears throat> PyCharm so what is PyCharm? PyCharm is an IDLE okay so PyCharm is an IDLE that will help you to code very frequently all these terminals and all those are here and <clears throat> what you need to know next is command lines okay so you have to know about command lines and I will also teach with the video and <clears throat> so let's discuss uh, what are command lines so if I go to CMD and this is our command console and over here terminal you can say and over here I can do like uh, CD space desktop and CD slash and all this and I will be uh, you can search in the Google or you can ask in Texamas that is our form okay so <clears throat> over here like uh, I want to make directory in C and make mkdir sorry mk mkdir I like that sorry mkdir covid and like that and if I search inside this folder I can see cd space covid and you can see over here like that okay let's keep this aside okay you can also I can also show you over here okay over here you can see okay. like this you have to know some basic of fire command lines and I will also uh, say what the functions are and like that so and then we want to install Django. So what is Django? Let's know about that. Django is a framework, okay? Framework. And what is framework? So framework, let's keep make two parts, frame plus work, okay? So using Python, someone has made a frame and in which you have to work. Like someone has made an application and in which you have to make some of these uh, um, edit and you can publish your own work like that frame plus work okay like uh, I can give you some more examples on frameworks like flask kiwi and pydroid and cyclone and etc okay so hope you guys have known what is framework and now we will start our project so after installing after installing the PyCharm go and open and I will not uh, tell you how you can install PyCharm and I can make separate video if you want you can comment okay so our PyCharm is opening I think until then we have to go to you can set up all those things so after opening python i will meet you guys okay we have our pycharm over here and this is the interface uh, i will leave the link of download okay in the description box below so simply click on create new project and after that give the project name like i want to be django tutorials tutes okay and over here select python to, uh, sorry python interpreter as existing interpreter okay so after doing this you can code and let's create 
just click on create and wait till it loads okay we have opened our project let's close this and you can see over here our project is done and <clears throat> you will be like that like this your window is be like this and click on this little box over here and you will see this interface now go to terminal and you can also test python console like over here like okay and try your console over here like this print sorry django and you can see it's printing and that's good let's go to terminal and you want to do what you want to do it what you want to do is just write this command pip install django and if you have not uh, upgraded version of pip you can do pip double dash upgrade install pip and your pip will be upgraded I think my pip is already up to date so yeah okay so it's giving us error just let it be so let's do install Django so to ja install Django over here you have to write pip install Django okay and it's done and if you want to specify version you can do just like this okay so we don't want to specify any version we want the latest one so let's hit enter as i have already installed it will show me already satisfied notification so we are done now what we want to do is just write this command django dash admin django admin start project and then start project and your project name so i want to give uh, folder covid django okay so let's wait until it creates our project and it's done and when i do like this you can see over here our skeleton is done now what we want to do is cd space CD space, sorry, CD space, uh, this file name that is coded for with Django, and it's done. And now we want what we want to do is python manage.py and run server. And what it will done is, do is it just runs your project in website. So if I hit enter and let's wait, okay, it's done. And we can go to this, okay, and 192, sorry, 127.0.1 is called zero zero zero, And it's done. The install worked successfully. Congratulations to you all guys and <clears throat> this much for today's video i think and if you want to just uh, off this you can do ctrl plus i don't know pause break i think okay you can also simply click this okay and that's all what we need and if i just do this refresh this it will not connect and if I do cd space code covid django and we uh, go to this folder and python manage.py and now sorry and run server server and yeah and if I do this and same thing and now we will be hope uh, just jump to another session next video how to create your own app web app okay thank
Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys like this video. If you guys do like, please hit that subscribe button and like button and share this video with your friends and family so that they could know how to build a Django framework Python tutor sorry website. And if you want to see some documentation of uh, this uh, Django framework tutorial, I have uploaded in my blog. You can get the link in the description box down below and you can enjoy making your own website. Thank you guys for watching this video. I'll meet you in the next one.